Hi, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the DFS Experience for Friday, August 25th. This video is brought to you by our friends over at Thrive Fantasy, player prop website where you can play against the house or play against other players in contest format. Nolan Arenado over under 0.5 hits. If you choose over, you get 80 points. If you choose under, you get 120 points. Trey Turner over under 1.5 total bases. If you choose over, you get 115 points. If you choose under, you get 85 points. If you use my promo code DFS Chapo, you do get a you do get a deposit match up to two fifty, or you can use the link that's in my description. Um, let's look at some of these pictures that I like for Friday slate. I ain't gonna lie to you. Um, this slate tonight, this Thursday slate. Like, all day, like, all the games today, early, main, it really took, um, it, it, it took the wind out of my body, took my breath away, you know what I'm saying? Just, I really get it today. After today, I really get it, and I really understand now why a lot of DFS players do not play MLB baseball, MLB DFS, and I see why a lot of DFS content creators don't make MLB videos. Like, I always knew why, but it really hit me today. Because this shit is a farce. MLB DFS is a fucking farce. Yo, what, what was up with JP France today? Wow. Yo, I don't even... I, I, I don't even know... I don't even know why I'm doing this video. Because... MLB DFS sometimes take my breath away. You feel me? Just take the words out of my mouth. Like, I don't know. I don't get it. There's no logic. There's no fucking rhyme or reason. This shit is a fucking free-for-all. Every night is a fucking free-for-all. Every night. If, you, if you're not understanding what I'm saying, like, boom. We got this Friday slate, right? Top pitcher, Spencer Strider. Obviously, he's going to be the highest projected pitcher on this slate, right? And he could just go out there and get smashed by San Francisco. And if you have Spencer Strider on your ticket, early night. That's what I'm saying. It's like, it's a fucking free-for-all, you know? And I don't know what to fucking tell you. If you play MLB DFS religiously... God bless your heart. All right. I mean, I play it religiously because I make content for it, but this shit is just, this is OD. It's really OD. Spencer Strider, 12.8K. If you want to pay up for him, you can pay up for him. I mean, if you pay up for him and things go left, early night, night, night. You know what I'm saying? Turn the Netflix on because there's going to be no MLB DFS for you to fucking watch. Um... Woodruff against San Diego, very risky. Lance Slynn against Boston. You see what Boston did to fucking J.P. France this morning, or Thursday morning. So, you know, tough matchup for Lance Slynn. Tough matchup for Logan Webb. Tough matchup for Sonny Gray. Y'all see a fucking pattern here? Like, this is, a, this is, this is a, a batter's league now. Fuck these pitchers. If you pay up for these bozos... And they get hit, what are you going to do? Your night is over. It's very tricky. It's very tricky and it's very risky. These, all these, listen. All these pitches are viable, obviously. You're not going to say Strider's not viable, but at what cost? He's 12.8K. And if San Francisco touches him, it's over. Same thing with Woodruff. He's a little bit cheaper, 10.4. If San Diego gets to him, night, night. Lance Lynn. Same shit. Dylan C's. The fuck has Dylan C's been doing? Look. Eight fantasy points. Negative 14 fantasy points. 23 fantasy points, but that's against the Yankees. 21 fantasy points against Milwaukee. And then five fantasy points against Colorado. This fucking guy can't be trusted. Look at these earned runs. Five, two, zero, seven, four. One, one, five, three. Like, the fuck am I supposed to do with that? 
Oh my god. Um I do like Mitch Keller against Chicago. Chicago just they can't put fucking hits together. They've been better, yes, but I don't trust them to you know from to go day in and day out to just hit the ball. I don't trust them to do all that. Um You Darvish, if you want to take a shot. Bryce Miller, if you want to take a shot. I don't think I'm touching BB against Toronto. Chris Bassett against Cleveland, I don't trust Chris Bassett. It's a personal thing. If I ran 10 crunches and one of them had Chris Bassett, I guess. But I don't trust Chris Bassett. Um... Back to Brady Singer. Now, we did that one time and we got lucky. I'm not going to do that again. Um, I played him. He put up 26 fantasy points. I faded him. He put up negative zero, negative 0. 0.4 fantasy points. Um, do you want to go back to him against Seattle? I guess you could. Listen, man, all, there's, there's no pitchers that really stand out. I like, I like Senga, as you can see. I pick Senga, but you know, you're talking about the Angels with no Otani and no um and no Trout. Um, so let's just let's just wrap this up. Strider, Woodruff, Lynn, Webb, Gray, Keller, Miller, Darvish. That's my player pool, and Brady Singer. Um, that's my player pool. Cutter Crawford against uh, the Dodgers? I don't think so. Kyle Hendricks? <sighs> against Pittsburgh? I don't know. I don't know if I'll be playing that many lineups. I'm going to need all those guys, but that's my player pool. For this lineup, I'm going with Senga. I'm going to try to stuff some Dodgers in there against Crawford. I like Betts. I like Will Smith. But I can't fit Freddie Freeman in there. I'm going with a few, um, Orioles. Um, my righties on my switch hitters. I'm gonna go with Austin Hayes. I'm gonna go with Santander. Let's go to draft. Let's go to draft kids. Let's go to Fanduel real quick. If you're new here, welcome. Appreciate you. Um, I appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Hit the bell. Thumbs up. If you if you're struggling with MLB and you would like me to send you my finalized optimal lineups, check out my Patreon link in the description. Fanduel. Um. We already just we already went through the pictures. And um FanDuel, same thing, nobody really jumps off jumps off the charts. I like Mitch Keller against Chicago. I mean he could get lit up too. Any every every anyone could get lit up, that's the thing. But I like Mitch Keller. For this FanDuel lineup, I'm a shoving Freddie Freeman. I'm going to pair him up with Mookie Betts. I'm going to go right back to Baltimore. Um, I love targeting Colorado pitchers. We're going go to we're gonna go with the two righties, Hayes and Mountcastle. And you know what? I'm going to just hope for the best because I can't call it. This shit is fucking crazy. This shit is, all, this shit is crazy. But, um, yeah, let me get out of here. I appreciate you guys watching this video don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed hit the bell thumbs up check out the patreon if you need lineups and i hope you guys had a profitable thursday night i'll talk to you guys later ciao